what is really funny is um, there's one guy that I know from the forums and from War Thunder Live who's a hapless little troll. He's constantly uh, causing trouble and has no respect for anyone Wait apart from War Thunder, you know, mods apparently, who he sucks up to on a regular basis. And in fact, he has a mod as one of his friends. However, this glitch that I know of, or have seen in action today, and I did test it out for five, six games just to see what it was all about. Um, yeah, he was caught, he, he was doing that. So I'm wondering whether he's been given a one day ban and a rollback on his account. I really hope he has, because he's an absolute douchebag. What, are you trying to say he won't be because he's friends with all the mods? No, 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 not at all. If he, the thing is, what they're gonna, what they're doing is they're banning people that have been grossly exploiting it. Um, I mean, like I say, I did five to six games early one as a test, and that, well, it obviously isn't really massively exploiting it. What I mean by massively exploiting it, I mean by basically taking out, you know, bombers into arcade battle and crashing every single one of them as soon as you spawn in with them. That's what people were doing. And they fixed that yesterday. Or, like, yeah, yesterday now. Um, but they didn't fix the realistic battles one. And people were still doing it in the realistic battles one as soon as they found out about it. I noticed it, like, on patch day release, but didn't twig to it. I saw a few bombers going down and was like, it's a bit weird, never mind, you know. It happens. People crash B-17s in this game on the running to the target because they go too quick. They do it with Lancasters as well, they do it with Wellingtons. You know, it happens all the time. Um, but no, this was an actual glitch, it was a real problem, a real bug. And apparently people were literally th farming hundreds of thousands worth of RP from just doing that. Because you could do it. You know, you could finish a game in less than four minutes and you'd be guaranteed to get, um, I don't know, 10,000, 20,000 RP. Considering, you know, arcade, it's, you can take out multiple bombers, obviously, like I say. Um, and that's what people were doing, like, and uh, that's how people were abusing it. It was just a, a horrendous bug, and how it got through the development stage, I have no fucking idea. Well, these visibility mechanics, I mean, really, yeah. Just, I can see that Lancaster over there, just, I guess. And there's two more of my eyes over there. And I'm in a team of uh, seven players. And yeah, I can see three others at the moment. There we go, B29. Right. He's pretty low as well. Yeah, I mean, he's really fucking low. He's chasing after the beat, uh, Lancaster, from what I can see there. There we go. Him. A little bit of damage to the wing, but not much. That goes to be 17, he just crashed. So, yeah, I mean, like I say, people crash bombers all the time in this game. It's. Yeah, it's a it's the standard feature since they added the random wing stopping to them <coughs> last year. Well, what you mean when they made the B seventeen like yeah? You know, well, it wasn't just B seventeen; it was every single bomber in the game. They get sniffed at and they die. But no, 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 it was when you know you could break the wings off on a B seventeen <laughs> doing two hundred and twenty miles an hour. 
Remember that? <laughs> it's just fucking ridiculous. You, you just had to like, like hot, a fucking harsh wind would <laughs> snap the wings off. <laughs> Remember when we did that massive B-17 flyout? Yeah, yeah. Like I've still got the video on uh, YouTube. Was that that? No, that wasn't the same one. Surely. No, was there was, it? One, was we another one. Hokkaido, which was the really good one. I think was the video you had, but there was another one we did, which was um, uh, it was a squadron battle we did, and it was night time, right. and uh, all the lights from like the ships were on us, the searchlights, and like three of the guys snapped their wings off. Their planes just like obliterated and caused a load of us to crash. I'm pretty sure you were in that one as well. Not sure. Oh yeah, because no, we managed to get like three squads of us into a game. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm sure I was in that one. I but remember one we, when we did that. I his B-25 complaining that we were all too fast for him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but dude, if I was to go as slow as you, I'd fucking still, fall, out, yeah. like, fall out of the sky. <laughs> Would I use the kicker? Um, I don't mind doing a game with it, but it's just like, I don't really have anything to farm for it, if you know what I mean, so I wouldn't necessarily be fighting really hard in it. There's no motivation, if you understand what I mean. I mean, I'd still play to win, but, yeah, it's just a little bit different. I'm not being as competitive as I can be when I'm fighting in something that's fully spent. I mean, I'm, with regards to the Japanese, because I'm not researching anything, I'm more likely to let other people have kills. Because I'm a sportsman like that. I still want to get at least a kill, but unless my team are absolute puddings, then, uh, you know, I'll quite happily let them get kills themselves. <laughs> yeah, you saw that SLH. Yeah, it's uh, it was quite amusing. I did, like I say, test it out and was just like... What, what, I mean, I think this was after they spotted it. It was still in the game. I mean, I had um, a game where I did literally nothing. I just flew the plane straight into the ground and got 5,000 RP for it. Um, that was in the... I did, like... What was it? One game in that, I did one game in B29, and I think three games in the um, Lancaster Mark 1. But the reason why I did it in the Lancaster Mark 1 was because it was, um, I had free repairs for it. So it wasn't going to cost me anything to just do that. Because you don't, you didn't get any, uh, like, lines reward for doing it. You just got RP reward for doing it. It was just really, really fucking weird. The 4.0 kicker. What, they've dropped the battle rain down for it? Or do you mean you're on about the SPD or the... What's it called? The TBD Devastator. I've flown new P38. It's not yet. I've unlocked uh, one of them. I think I've almost unlocked another. Um, we shouldn't... Oh, they've got another bomber. At least. Great. Apparently they're really high. As far as the um, new P38 is going, I've seen the, um, at least I've seen a couple in game, you know, people that have been flying. You know, as far as unlocking them goes, it's not a problem really. I've mainly been farming for the Hunter because it's the biggest uh, grind out there as far as the aircraft goes. Um, plus, as far as the tanks go, yeah I, yeah, I did a little bit of testing with the tanks yesterday and with those realistic tank markers I, <laughs> I'm really not impressed they kind of should just rename realistic battle now tank battle to hardcore um, arcade mode idea where these enemy are. They're either in the clouds down there or they're trying to get into orbit. I know one of them at least was a bomber because he destroyed at least one of our bases. 
though where they are now, I have not got a fucking clue. Oh, no, they're attacking area field, so they've got B-29s over area field, I guess. Or maybe not, maybe that was a B-17, okay. I see him, aha! Straight towards me, pretty much. Well, no, no, wow, wow, no, that's not the Twitch going crazy, that's stuttering on the game, that's the new visibility mechanics going. <laughs> <laughs> I think that was his Baron von Games impression. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, yeah. Oh, you know. You could voice act for Goat Simulator. The <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Goat Simulator. I don't sound like a goat. Sam might be good at that. Sally, Sean, get in here. That's, um, this, as far as the music goes, I couldn't have, like, asked for it to be any better as far as, uh, you know, in relation to what I'm flying at the moment. Sam's probably standing on a box at the moment holding his hand to his chest and crying. <laughs> Fucking perfect. And they've got one left somewhere. I have no idea what he's in there. I think it, there was a bear cat up. No, that's not him. Great. Okay. Don't know what he's in. The only thing that could make me proud is if you'd cover your plane in, uh, in British flags. It's got flags. British insignia on it. I'm not going to do that, that's just asking to, for trouble. <laughs> it's asking for every Russian to shoot at me ever. You no, know, I actually had to educate uh, a friend of mine the other day. Um, people refer to it as the Union Jack. And isn't it only a Union Jack if it's on board a ship? If it's not on board a ship or being flown on a ship, it's uh, a Union flag. Eh. Mm. Didn't know that. Really? Yeah. Well, you checked that and that's what it says. Yeah, no, I checked that. It's like when they, um, because I first clocked it like five or six years ago when they said the flag, the Union flag is flying at half mast over Buckingham Palace. And I was like, isn't it a Union Jack? And then I went and checked. It was like, no, it's only a Union Jack if it's uh, being on flown the on the mast of a ship. Yeah. Uh, uh, the last one is in a bomber and he's right above me. There he is, between nine. Fuck, I'm dead. And more than likely, the airfield is dead as well. I might not be dead thinking about it. Oh, 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 two seconds. I'm not dead. I'm not dead! He's only got the spawn bomb load. I think. And that's it. Is the base okay? What? What? Oh, I want to see this. What happens? Yeah, you'll you'll see what happens there. That B twenty nine. Yeah. 
<laughs> Mean Size just hit the nail on the head. <laughs> I think eighty dollars is a bit cheap, dude. Oh shit, nice. <laughs> mean Size. Mean, <laughs> they're talking about ships on War Thunder and Mean Size, and I said when they come out in six years, and Mean Size said you'll have to buy into Daily Coast Beta sessions for eighty dollars. <laughs> It's fucking perfect. You'll also have to uh, switch your allegiance to, to, to Russia. Yeah, <laughs> tie the NDA. If, if you don't, yeah. And if you don't like the game, then you go to the gulag. <laughs> <laughs> and if you're a YouTuber, unless you sign the agreement, the uh, you know the KGB is going to come for you in your sleep. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, you're not going to be able to create a free account without first entering in your uh, credit or debit card details. Yeah, as far as what happened in game goes, that that was kind of bullshit. I uh, the you bombs. Missed the runway. Yeah, the bomb. Well, I respawned at the other end of the runway. The bombs were exploding at the other end of the runway, and I get killed. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no. I see what you mean. Like I was on about when you um when you were being uh, treasure hunter. What? Like when once you pass that repair timer, there's that little momentary lag yeah. before you spawn at the end of the runway. I was saying you didn't die there, but as for spawning at the end and dying, I've got no fucking clue. Yeah, yeah. Well, <laughs> working is intended. Thank. Oh. And uh, back of vehicles. It seems like the past two many? days I've been playing this game when I thought I'd be raging. It's actually, <laughs> like, you know, I've never laughed so hard in my life. <laughs> oh. Well, I described it yesterday as the divine comedy of.